Hey guys, it's Kuli again with another video and uh, this time I've got something special. I mean, something I've been meaning to buy for some time now. It's been a long, long time and you guys have been very vocal about that also. So, uh, without further ado, I present to you the Zoom H1 uh, recording, well, thingamajig, which you can use to record your audio. Uh, standalone device for my video work so stay tuned for that so guys uh, probably you guys already know if you have been watching my videos uh, my audio setup is just my camera. My camera does not have a 3.5 mm jack to connect a audio source. So I have been using the inbuilt audio microphone and it hasn't been very good. And I have been thinking of uh, buying a audio recorder or basically a microphone for some time now. But the problem with buying a microphone is that my, my camera does not have a 3.5 mm jack. It is an A6000. Um, and uh, it does not come with a 3.5 mm jack. I had to get the shotgun microphone from Sony, which mounts in the hot shoe, and uh, that's going to be much difficult. So I have to either way use the microphone with a third party application, uh, or basically my laptop. I have to connect it to my laptop and then stream it in that way, then sync it up in post production. So a uh, better way to do that is with something like this, which is an external audio recorder, which is a standalone device which accepts a micro SD card slot, and you will be able to record directly onto this. And the microphone in here is a unidirectional pattern microphone, so that is going to cut out a lot of the noise, which you probably are going to hear because I'm not using this right now. I just got this, and I want to do an unboxing of this. And uh, there is a hell of a lot of noise. There are crows, there are goats, there are roosters and all that around me. So I'm sorry for this video, but from next video onwards, I will be using this thing to get stuff done. So hopefully that'll be soon. Now let's get to the opening. Now, first of all, let's see what is this. This uh, shows that the world needs creators. Yes, the world certainly needs them. Uh, people willing to contribute something, something original, inspiring, powerful, all that. Really nice to see. Now let's get to the features. Now, first of all, it is an XY uh, micro microphone, so that is the X and Y axis of the microphones, and you will get a stereo sound from that. Uh, Twenty-four bit, eighty-six K audio, low cut filter in build and auto level controls on board, so that's pretty cool. It does have a USB function, so you can connect it to your laptop or your USB peripheral and get a better audio recording environment. Records on micro SD cards up to 32 gigs. I'm not entirely sure if 32 gigs is a limitation of this device because honestly, if uh, the device accepts 32 gigs, it should be able to accept 64, 128. Not entirely sure about 128 because it is actually XC. It says it has 10 hours of operation on one single AA battery, and this does uh, look for one AA battery. It needs to power that with one AA battery. I need to buy new batteries, but it comes with a double A battery in build, so that is a good thing. So what do you get? It, it you get the handy recorder, you get a micro SD card slot, and well micro SD card and the battery. That is it in the packaging. Let's open it up. Also, you get two bundle softwares, which are the uh, Cubase LE and Wavebase LE, which are audio modification, audio correcting applications, and you do get two m two gigs of micro SD card slot. So yeah, let's open this up and see what you get. Now I have not opened this up. I have tried opening it up, but uh, well, didn't want to do it off the camera. So I will be opening this up, showing you guys what we get here. So we have your creators. Okay, that's good to know. And uh, okay. So this is the, oh yes, this is the product which we have and the AA battery. That is amazing. You get that. Let's keep that aside for now. Now here is the extra other stuff which you 
get with this. So that is a micro SD with the adapter. So yeah, that is always nice to see. Uh, let's open this up and see what we have in here. So first thing is a quick start guide. So that is good. That's amazing. Uh, I would love to have a quick start guide because I have no idea how this thing works. I have no idea how to use this thing, but I am going to learn because I need to learn for this. So I'll be keeping this with me for now. And we have a warranty register, so it's for North America. I'm not entirely sure what I should do with that, but uh, I think I should send it to someone. Not entirely sure. So yeah. Then you have uh, QBase LE and Wave WaveLab LE uh, download codes, so you will get the code from here. I'm going to use this. I'm not going to give this away right now. So sorry, guys. And then you have the handy recorder. Uh, what is this? Handy recorder or something. This is a uh, do not throw garbage mode. So this is the software version history, just some other technicality. And there is another SD card usage precautions, which uh, I'm not entirely sure why it's included, but hey, it is included. That's good. And finally, the micro SD card slot. Now, this is a class 6 micro SD card slot. They are not uh, a branded one. Uh, this is going to be a cheap one, not issue. Not, not an issue. I mean, I can get 32 hours of recording with the 2 gig uh, on the low setting on this recorder. So, I'm happy with that. 2 gigs is plenty enough for me right now. So, that is the documentation which you get. Now, let's get started on the recorder. So, here is the handy recorder. It is tiny i didn't think it'll be this tiny it does have a screw hole i am going to use that for my videos so that's uh, another thing which i'm going to do uh here is the double a battery which i frankly do not know how to get out uh i will try okay i got that out so here's the battery i will be turning it on and just see how this works Okay, let's turn on. Yay! It's on! And I can see the battery life is full. And I can start recording. Let's see. Okay, I had to edit this stuff. I'll try and do that. No card. Okay, I have to insert the next SD card slot. So yeah, I have started this up. And I will be showing you guys how to do this thing working. Um, again, I'm really excited about using this product to my advantage on these videos and hopefully you guys are also um i can see the uh, audio levels and uh am i peaking yes i am peaking i was peaking there hello yeah i was peaking that is good um i will be trying to learn how to use this and as quickly as i can uh, probably in the next video I, you will be hearing stuff from here i will be making a review of this also if i will i'm able to do that probably i will be able to as soon as i can as soon as i know how to use this and i use this a couple of times just to know how the difference is so stay tuned for that and i hope that does help you guys in uh, deciding something um so yeah, I guess that much is it about the video then. I hope you guys liked the video. Please just subscribe and like the video if you found it useful. See you guys next time. Bye.